Thought of the day. My thought of the day is a little different. I had the word invest. Invest, what does that mean? Well, invest means you put something in to get more out. To make a profit. We know at the moment, as times are, it's not worth putting money into a bank because you won't get much back. Invest. Farmers invest in their farms. They spend a vast amounts of time, effort and money to plough, to get ready the land and then to sow the seed. And over time the seed will grow and they still look after it. They still invest their time and put effort into their crops. And eventually the crops are ready to be harvested. Again, they invest time and money and machinery to get the harvest in. But eventually they can sit back and reap the rewards of their hard work, their time and their effort. God wants us to invest in him. He says, if you put your effort, your time into him, you will gain. You will gain more than you can ever, ever imagine. But God also invests in us. God has invested in us, so much so that he has put a deposit on us. The deposit was Jesus Christ, his son, on the cross. You have been paid for. There is a part payment for your life. It's there for the taking, eternal life with him. He has invested in you. If you like one life for many. So what effort, what pain can you go through to bring someone to Jesus? One life for many. God has invested in you. Go, go and bring many to him. He says the harvest is ready, but the labourers are few. Go, you labourers, bring in the harvest. You will be rewarded in heaven. There are many out there that belong to God. In fact, they all belong to God. Most of them don't know. Most of them don't know that they have had a deposit put on them for their lives, for their very souls. We seem to have more time to think more time to dwell on the things that maybe we've done wrong we could do different but dwell on this that Jesus Christ is the deposit on your life you have been set free from slavery God has invested in you and he wants a return he wants a profit on his investment But we know that when we invest in God, we gain so much more than money, so much more than riches on earth. We gain eternal life and we gain a love and a forgiveness that the world cannot give us.
go and preach the word. Tell others how great is our God. And he has put a deposit on their lives.